Hello, everyone, and welcome to Advanced Word Processing for the Braille Note Touch Plus. In this section, we are going to cover some of the more advanced skills aside from open or er, from creating and writing and saving in a document. So this portion of the series will be split up into three different sections, just so um, you have bite-sized chunks to learn from. Before we get started, I want to remind everyone of two ways that you can access help if you get stuck or if you forget a command. So if you don't remember a command for a certain um, keystroke or action that you want to do, you can use the context menu and you will get there by pressing space plus M and that will open the context menu up for you. You also can get into your context menu holding your recent apps button for two seconds and that will also open the context menu for you. So you can navigate this context menu by using the next and previous thumb keys to move around to the different menus. And then when you find the um, submenu that you want, you just go ahead and press enter. If you need to go even deeper into a submenu, again, navigate with your thumb keys. And then another thing to point out is that as you move through like various commands that you can use, the keystroke is going to be spoken out loud for you, and that's so you can use those keystrokes in the future to access the action more quickly. The other way you can get help is by um, pressing space, space plus H, and that's going to open up your context sensitive help. And so what will happen then is a dialog box will open and it will provide you of some information about the context that you're focused in. It will list commands that you can do and use on particular and it will explain how to execute them. Again, to navigate the topics in this um, contextual help, just use your next and previous thumb keys. And when you're done using contextual help, do a space E for exit or you can use the back button. So the first section of this um, part of the series, we're going to talk about how to open documents. And then once you've opened documents, how to switch between multiple documents. All right. In this section of advanced word processing, we're going to start out by talking about opening a document and then switching between documents. So first to open a document, we are going to use the main menu of keyword. So right now I'm going to start from my main menu and then I'm going to jump to um, keyword using first letter navigation. So W. Word processor keyword. I'm going to hit enter. Keyword menu. So Create. Right now, um, the touch has placed me in the um, in the main menu, and I'm on create, and I want to find open. Open. I'm going to hit enter. Key files. Bad jokes. Dot docs. So what has happened is once I've hit open and enter, the touch has placed me directly into my documents folder. Now, if I want, I can go to any of my folders. Um, I can do that by, so first, if I wanna find a document that's just saved in my documents folder, I can use my thumb keys to navigate between the, the files in my documents folder. But if I want to go to a different folder, I'm gonna use my back button. Alarms folder. And now it's placed me in this main list of folders um, on the hard drive of my touch. And so again, I would use my thumb keys to find a particular folder I was looking for and open the file that way. Once you open your folder or your folder or your document that you're looking for and you hit enter, the touch is going to put you right back in it into editing mode. So next. All right. And now next, I'm going to be demonstrating how to switch between multiple documents. For the purposes of this video, I'm actually just going to open some documents that are in my 
um, documents folder. So I'm going to jump down. Some folder. Documents folder. All right. So I'm going to hit enter. Check bad jokes dot docs. And I'm going to open bad jokes. Edit box. End of document. And then as you can see, I am in edit mode and I can go ahead and I can start writing in my document. So let's say, what if you want to work in a couple different documents, maybe one you're reading information one, or maybe you're just working on a project that requires you to be in two different documents at one time. Let's go ahead and see what that's, that would look like. So to open another document, we're going to hit our back button to get to our main menu. Keyword menu open. And we're already, we're, we were already on open. So we're just going to hit enter again. Key files. Bad jokes dot docs. So we already have bad jokes open. So let's see what else we have. Jokes. Let's just do jokes again. Doc. Edit box. Dessert. So now it's got me in this jokes document, which is the one I'm currently working in. But let's say I want to move back to the bad jokes document. So the command for that is space plus dots one, two, five, six. Edit box key files. Bad jokes dot docs. And what this is going to do is it's going to put you in a list of the documents that you have currently open. And then all you have to do is you just need to use your thumb keys and you can select which document that you want to um, get into. Jokes. So if I, jokes. Hit, if I hit enter, I can go right back into jokes. It is important to keep in mind, if you have not saved this document already, it is going to prompt you to save it again and you will just um, do follow the same prompts that we've discussed in how to and how to save um, in those previous videos. Um, and then it's also important to know that when you go between two documents, your cursor is going to be wherever you left it the last time that you were working in it. So that's in another that's another important important point. But switching between documents, super simple. Again, we're going to do a space plus dots one, two, five, six. It will open up a list. You will select your document. You will press enter and you can go back and work in it.